Howdy PvP enjoyers, this is going to be the first installment of my training room series. In the training room series I'm going to grab a certain build or a certain weapon or an Ash of War or maybe some magic or a combination of all those above and I'm going to do my best to show you how to use them effectively in the best way that I can. I'm going to show you some duels and some invasions and you know I'm going to tell you the best ways to use these things in either of those scenarios. Um, I don't think I'm the best player out there, but I have been doing PvP for 10 years, ever since Dark Souls 1. So I think I'm at least mildly qualified to talk about this stuff. I don't think I'm the best player, at least I'm pretty sure I'm not. But, um, I hope I can help you. I hope this is supposed to be infotainment, it's supposed to inform you and educate you. So, I hope you enjoy. If you like stuff like this, like and subscribe. And stick around for more because I'm going to keep pumping these out as fast as I can. Because, you know, I really enjoy making them. And dislike if you dislike the video also because I need to know that. I just started doing this. I need the input. Anyway, let's get to the build now. Okay, so the first thing I got to tell you right up front, right off the bat, is this build is fucking stupid. Let me show you why. Damn, holy shit. Got fucked up. This is fucking wild. <laughs> Okay, before you get all upset, the reason I made this build is because basically the way that the, gank the gankers are playing now, they're basically using shit like this constantly, all the time, okay? Like, you may as well fight fire with fire at this point. You can either get shit on and use honest builds, or you can become the douche and have a chance. Uh, so I decided I was gonna, you know, have a chance and ascend to the top of the food chain. That's what I did. That's what this build is for. Okay, so I'm going to explain to you how to use this properly now. So this is essentially an L1 build. I'm going to explain why. This procs bleed in like one L1 attack usually on most people. Your bread and butter is this right here. That hits four times, instantly procs bleed in 99% of people, and can roll catch. This is the roll catch pattern. One, two, three. That will catch panic rollers. Okay, so even without seppuku, this will usually cause bleed in just one attack. But if you add seppuku, basically all you have to do is tickle somebody with it and it bleeds them. It, it's ridiculous. If you put it on both weapons, it's really stupid. But um, that's essentially your main good attack. That's where your bread and butter is. You know, that's where most of your damage is going to come from. And uh. You know, it, that kind of sucks. I don't really like builds like that, but it is very effective, I gotta say. See, this stuff right here, it doesn't have a lot of range, not a lot of forward momentum. You know, it's not very good for turn and burns because it doesn't have the range. It's, uh, you know, it's just not very viable to use all the time. You can get away with these more in duels than you can in invasions. I wouldn't even do this in invasions unless you're attempting a turn and burn. But, um, you have one other useful attack, which is the jumping L1. I believe that hits four times also, it usually procs bleed very quickly, but both of these attacks are very useful. Not these, but this, and you're jumping L1. So th yeah, this is basically an L1 machine. It's an L1 machine that melts people. Ever since I've made it, my IQ has dropped at least 30 points, and I wake up in the middle of the night in a cold sweat trying to hit L1. It's, it's fucked up, okay? I have PTSD. Um, so in a way, I don't recommend this build, but I... I also do. It, I should have titled this video How to Break Elden Ring PvP, because that's basically what I'm doing. Now don't get me wrong, you'll still lose with this. You're not invincible with this. Ganks can still overpower you and buttfuck you, essentially. But, you know, that's essentially how you use the build. That's the most effective way to use it. It is an L1 machine, okay? Here's my gear. I, I really recommend high poise, okay, because you can poise through, like, everything with 72 poise, except for glaives and ultra great swords and stuff like that. But any kind of small weapon, you can poise right through it. I can even poise through rivers of blood with 72 poise and one-shot people with my scavengers. Um, I also recommend magic iron round shield with carry and retaliation for easy parries and the parry spells. I also recommend the pulley crossbow with blood bolts or burnt bolts so that you can harass mages who keep spamming you or you know just to deter people. You know you can harass people with crossbows that's really easy and you can cause bleed pretty easy too that way. This is the most important talisman on the build because every time you would use seppuku on yourself or cause bleed to someone around you it raises your attack power by 20 percent. So this is vital. This drastically increase increases your effectiveness all of these i have for obvious reasons especially bull goats um and yeah here's my stats this is a pretty well-rounded arcane build um 
I could have taken it higher and made it even more stupid. At 45 arcane, this is fucking dumb, okay? That's all I got to say. If I went up to 60, it'd be really stupid, like, dumb as fuck, okay? I probably wouldn't even want to play with it. But the rest of the build is basically a vigor build. <laughs> um, it's pretty well-rounded, I suppose. I stayed at level 90 because invasions and PvP in general are just better at level 90. Um, if you're curious why, ask me in the comments, I'll explain. Um, anyway, let's get started with some duels. That's going to be our, our first part, and then I'll get to some invasions after. Hey, dude! Hey. What's up? That thing's going to fucking hurt. Might even hurt worse than mine, and that says a lot. Alright, I just gotta, I just gotta get past the range. What are you doing, man? Are you trying to waste my seppuku? Is that what you're doing? Alright. Let's get it. Ultra Great Sword Poke? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, man. You got nuked, and it wasn't really your fault. He tried hard, you know, that's a pretty cool build. Pretty cool strategy, too. Hey, dude. What's good? What weapon is that? Oh, that's that crusty-looking sword. Margots. It's Margots. I don't see that a lot. I might be in for surprise. Unorthodox weapons fuck me up sometimes, because not a lot of people use them. Oh, okay, you're buffing. It's okay. I'm not going to smack you. I know the rules. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. I'm a poised bleed monster. You can't do anything about it. Are you fucking serious, bro? Nah, no, fuck you. Dumb motherfucker. I don't care if I am using bleed. You don't get to heal on me. Little bitch. Hey, look at this guy. Look, another honest bleed build, just like me. My, But we're like two, two bleeds in a pod. I love you. I love you. Alright, let's fight. Let me just uh, Sudoku real quick. All right, let's do our thing. Oh, he's got Bloodhound Step. I'm going to lose this because of that alone. I don't know how to beat Bloodhound Step reliably. He's not doing running L1s too much. Oh, I might be in luck here. I pivoted. Got Dark Souls 1 PTSD. Come on, man. Thank you for not Bloodhound step cheesing me. I love you. I still love you, even though you're dying. Let's get to it. I can't poise through the moon veil, obviously. Roll catch. Oh god, I'm so sorry, buddy. I'm so sorry. Hey. Oh yeah, dude. <laughs> he got scared as soon as he saw the Sabuku. Alright, I'm probably gonna lose this, actually, because he's... He's got the stopping power to get me. He has stopping power, I cannot poise through that. Oh shit, well, good game, man. I thought he was gonna win, actually. That was a hard counter to what I'm using. But anyway, good luck, man. Oh, you're all fucked. And I honestly feel sorry for you. You're all fucked hard, like harder than fuck. Fucked is an understatement. Host? Moonveil! I wanna play, I wanna play with the Moonveil. Can I touch it? Oh god, Jesus Christ. I am so sorry, buddy. And not really, he had a Moonveil, I have no respect for that. Even though my build's just as bad. I'm going in for the kill. Sorry about this, guys. Oh, I'm so sorry. 
God damn. Oh, where's your hostie? Hostie, come here. Are you gonna disconnect? I kind of thought he was for a second. Dumb motherfucker. That's not gonna work. <laughs> you can't cheese me. I'm cheesing you, bud. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I was mean. I just hate rot breath. I hate it. Fucking pussies. Oh my god. Oh, hey, dudes. Can I buff? Oh my god, you guys suck. I'm gonna feel dirty for this. Pussy. Bloodhound step. It's not gonna work, bro. Your Bloodhound step won't save you. Bleed is the hard counter to Bloodhound step. No, not really. I barely even got him. <laughs> I smell a super gank. Me and you? All of us? Are we all fighting? I think we are. Oh, that was lucky. <laughs> it's called burst damage, dude. You should try it. I think they're hiding. It's not going to work out, though. I promise. I'm gonna punish you for that. I'm so mad right now. That's what happens when you piss me off trying to rot breath cheese me, little bitch. Hmm. Seriously? Elden Stars? What level are you, dude? Holy shit. I can just tell this is an overleveled phantom. I can tell immediately. Alright, that problem's dealt with. Let me just rebuff. Give me a moment. I knew I could poise tank. Well, it's not really a poise tank. I just killed him before I could get it off all the way. Alright, now where is... Where the fuck is the host? No. He is not up there, is he? He's running to the boss. Hmm. I'm gonna try, uh, Phantom. Alright. Now... Where is he? He's right there. Is he calling his buddies? I think so. I think most likely yes. It's a good thing I have huge burst damage. Where's your cooperator? I know there's somebody here. What the fuck are you doing? Are you drunk? I'm gonna stay on you like flies on shit. Alright. Good game, buddy. Uh, you kind of pissed me off just because you kept walking away, you know? It's kind of kind of annoying. Hang in there, Red. Hang in there. I'm coming. Hang in there, Red. I got the Phantom. Job well done. Now let's get this ganking ass host. We have the power of God and anime on our side, motherfucker. I don't want to get too close because we're going to hate each other. 
All right, a job well done. Pleasure working with you. Hey. Hey, he's an edge lord. He can't even say goodbye. I love you. Oh hey. He's not gonna let me buff, is he? Let's get him. Oh my god, I'm fat rolling. Let's see if I can beat him while I'm fat rolling. <laughs> That's my bad. I need to change the build real quick. Um, Alright. I already fixed that problem real quick. He's about to jump on me. I hear him. Oh my god. I've made a mistake. Alright, now I gotta get back up there. Uno momento. I, I, I put myself up to the ultimate test. Can you win PvP fat rolling? I guess the answer is yes. If I can do it, you can. Alright. Let me just hit this dude up. Wait, why are you down there? I thought we were fighting up here. Damn, that's luck. That was luck. Holy shit. Are you guys really gonna hide in there? Who's got Rivers of Blood? I know one of you does. No, he's just got Moonveil. Are you guys scared? Mm, they are scared. They're very scared. Ah, I misjudged that. Misjudged the range. I might have to go cast the other Seppuku. Or let them use up their FP. God damn it. I couldn't see him. Don't do it. Oh, your host save you. God damn. This is tough. It's actually kind of tough. I'm going to go recast the Puku real quick. Can I cast both? One Estus. All right, I gotta finish him quick, or I'm gonna I'm gonna be whittled down. You guys came out of your little safe room. That was a mistake. Moonveil. Fought battle. Huh, that was the first hard invasion I've had in a minute, like a while. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. Dumb motherfuckers. I have the power of God and the enemy on my side. Get fucked. Hmm, what kind of surprises am I gonna find in this little room? Oh, a super gank. Oh, there's only two. That's good. Seriously? Hey, hang on. I gotta... I gotta peace out for a second. Alright, I'll, I'll take care of you real quick. Which one casted the Stars of Ruin? gonna be hard to deal with or not yeah I'm a bleed build nothing's hard to deal with uh, he's still laggy I, I didn't know if he was gonna attack but, you know it's easy as that simple as pie oh bro you guys don't want to be fighting that boss when I show up phantom goes first
or you can go first if you're gonna pew pew me. Oh, that was uh, quick. Sorry about that. I hope you guys have good luck next time. This is a mistake. Stop now. Stop now. This is your last chance. Stop resisting. Dumbass. Hmm. Oh, God. I, I, I feel less filthy because they tried to spawn and kill me, but, you know, it's still, it's still fucked up. Oh, you guys are really close. I like that. Makes my job easier. Oh my god. I have to take out that wizard immediately. Hey, wizard. You got that big dumb sword that's not good. Oh my god! Jesus. That sword is not good. It should be easy. It's gonna be easy anyway, because I'm using a lead build. Jesus Christ! Oh my god! Fuck! Oh. Oh. Yeah, you better run, bro. Get the fuck away from me right now. I fucking told you. Should've got the fuck away from me. Like I told you. I tried to warn you, bro. I'm, I'm sorry. Don't run. Come on. Let's not play this game. You know I'm gonna win. I'm not stupid. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I only had one buff. I didn't even have both. Fucking stupid. <laughs>